Yo, what's going on, Sexy Simulator Squad? I got a Pog idea. It involved Hebo, but then he banned Hebo. So that idea went out the window, but I have another Pog idea. So here's the thing. Ow, Kwong. Notorious low cooldowns, right? Six seconds on the three. That's not bad, dude. That's not bad at all. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to spend... I'm going to buy med, and then I'm going to spend 800 instantly lowering my cooldowns, and I'm going to go Horn Shard. And then I'm just going to go tier two Telkines with some potions or tier one Telkines with some potions. And this is basically going to eliminate my cooldowns for what I assume is going to be three spell casts of my three. So I'll press that button. I will press my cooldown buttons. Although I have to wait for him to like all in me. I, I, I got to wait for him to, it's time to nut up or shut up situations, you know? Boom. Bozo. Fight me. Bozo. Fight me. Fight me, huh? Fight me. Clap at me again. Clap at me again. You think I'm scared of you? I don't even need to use my cooldowns. He's AFK. Alright. Oh my god. My cooldowns, dude. Insta clear the wave, out poke him. What do you think you're doing? Who do you think you are? It ain't it ain't it ain't that deep, brother. Slow. Three. And that's the first blood. It took a lot of gold to do. It took an extra eight hundred uh schmeckles to pull that off, but it did work. And hey, I mean sometimes. You got to break the meta to invent something. You're not going to reinvent the meta by using the meta. You know? And I got to be honest, that felt pretty damn good. That felt pretty good. You just pop the the coolies. And by the way, when meta is upgraded, it's only 10 seconds longer of a cooldown than shards. So like... You can do that every two minutes. Every two minutes in game, you can just have no cooldowns for six seconds. That's pretty busted. Uh, I will admit, what's not busted <clears throat> is the fact that I have no items yet. But I make up for that by killing. Are you backing or are you lying? He's still level five. He might ult me here. If he does, fair play. He's not ulting me. I have 30 seconds left on my Omega cooldowns. Well, I definitely should not. Oh, wow. I do a lot of damage. Okay. Actually, I was going to say I definitely should not have been chucked into tower there, but I think being chucked into tower was actually a good play. All right, now I back and I go Telkine's ring. If you ult me, you're a bitch. Let's go. He didn't ult. We go Telkine's ring. The reason I go Telkine's ring, by the way, is because first item, it's pretty good because it has 10% magical lifesteal. And the uh, the damage that you get from bonus auto attacks is actually scaling per level rather than per magical power. So, like, it's it's three damage per level. So, it's it's a stagnant, pretty decent amount of damage at all points. So you're gonna run away. Don't act like you aren't. Uh. Oh, ouch. Oh, ouch. You know, I am curious. What if I just killed him? Oh my god, bro. Look at that cooldown. Look at that cooldown. There's no way. Holy. Yo, why has nobody thought of this before? Why has nobody done this before? This is actually insane. Like, 
I guess I kind of understand why nobody's done it before because you have no kill potential after that first like initial 10 seconds. But like, geez louise, man. Am I scared he's going to kill me here? Absolutely not. I am thinking twice about this human form. Don't ult me. Okay. Oh my god. Okay, I juked him. We're cheeky boys. We're cheeky boys. We're cheeky boys. Oh man. Okay. I'm safe. I'm safe. We're fine. Oh, he's going for my blue. No. That's mine. No. Darn tootin'. You got my blue buff. All because I went for the greedy blue buff play. That's okay. We're still a thousand gold ahead of him. The Telkines is putting in work. Which my next item be? I'm thinking a Berserker Shield. Oh, you know what I could do is I could get more cooldown reduction. All right, let's do that. I like the idea of that. Uh, what's 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 cooldown here? Oh, breastplate. Breastplate is cooldown. Yes. Yeah. All right. Cool. So now I have twenty percent cooldown reduction. I guess thirty percent because of blue buff. Plus, actually, like cooldown reduces. Dude, it's just insane, man. He can't run. Oh, good beads. I'm actually okay with that, though. I didn't know you got the heal from your alt, even if they beads it. That's interesting. I wish I knew more things about Smite. If you alt me... Oh, never mind. He's not even charging. We're chilling. All right, tower's down. You do a grand total of absolutely do not scare me. Oh, that one didn't detonate and kill. Okay, does he ult though? Oh, no, I have to back. Get me out of here. All right, more attack speed. Toxic Blade would be good, but also, uh, let's just give him some more damage. Now, I know I can get my second Relic here, but that kind of defeats the whole meme, huh? The whole meme is Horn Shard plus Meditation is like OP, 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 OP. By the way, fun fact, I am using my Meditation before my Horn Shard, which is lowering the cooldown of my Horn Shard using my Meditation proc. So, in case you're wondering what, what that is all about. You do not even come close to winning a fight against me. Oh, I caught his dash! Ooh, you better ult. Just ult. Just ult. No? You're just gonna walk away? That's fair, too. That's fair, too. I respect a man who can walk away. You know, not everything has to end in a confrontation. You can just be like, you know what, dude? My bad. And W key yourself out of that situation. Uh, I want Cyclopean Ring because it gives you 10% cooldown, but it is 2,000 gold. But I guess I kind of like... This is... Uh, dude, am I cringe to think that Ao Kuang feels really good right now? I am fighting Mercury, which, you know, has no clear just like me, but still, like, at the same time. Yonk. I munched him. I munched him. Alright. Yo, peep. Peep the med. Peep the med cooldowns, bro. Peep the med cooldowns, bro. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Yo. Whoa. Whoa. 
That's insane. <laughs> I want you guys to try this. Like sometimes I'll do a meme and I'll and I'll say, actually most times I'll do some sort of a meme and I'll say, please do not attempt this. It won't go as well for you. It might, honestly. This is insanely good. Like I'm feeling. I'm feeling like I'm a like I'm a high level big brainer right now. I'm feeling like a, like a Sheldon Cooper, if you will. All right, he's not gonna ult me because he doesn't have the nut sack too. You think you can win a fight? He beads. He beads, but it was too late. <laughs> he beads while dying in the air, being executed. You poor thing. I'm. I, I actually feel sorry. I've been there, dude. We've all been there. We've all been there. You beads a second too late. All of a sudden, you're being executed, and there's a fist in your ass. It just happens. You never really know. Crazy stuff. I am max cooldown, by the way. With blue buff and then breastplate and cyclopean ring. I actually think I might be able to win this game. With no items. He surrendered. Dude. What an extremely strong build. Actually. That's insane. Now imagine that on Hebo. Oh my God. That would be even worse. I'm going to try to do the same thing with Hebo in, in tomorrow's video. Let me just warn you now. <laughs> but uh, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And until next time, y'all, peace.